the run out, it's Jalen Adams. Bell, baseline slam. The steal and the stuff. They just don't look like they've got that spark and that same energy that they've had. I think losing in general kind of made us want to win this game even more. We're trying to get back on track. This is going to be a fun matchup. A lot of star power here tonight. Today we have media day. We got to take headshots, team pictures. Quiet on set with the music. They tired too, bro. I know that was you. Hey fans, it's Jalen Green from Ignite. Watch us battle it out against the Long Island Nets. And is there anything that you like doing after you make a big shot or a dunk or whatever? Do you do like three, you do the... After I dunk, I usually yeah, do the... Yeah. <sighs> perfect, that's it boss, that was perfect. Konnichiwa Japan, Mabuha Philippines, G-Day Australia. Oh, no, it's a good day. It's a that's how they say it? Yeah, good day. But they, that's how they spell it right there though? Yeah, I know, right? That's what I hear. That's crazy, okay. Good day, Australia. Make sure you catch my G League highlights and action right here. Ignite got shellacked yesterday. A 40-point defeat to Erie. After the blowout, we kind of knew that we were going to have to come back stronger. And we knew that this next team saw that it was possible for us to be beat, and they were going to use that as motivation. Today we play the Westchester Knicks. They have Miles Powell, Jared Harper, Lou King. We just got to play our game and come out with the dub. Brandon Ashley making the short jump shot. Nice finish there at the rim by Dante Hall. How about this outlet from Kaminga? What a pass, the QB Kaminga. And then you got to really credit Hall. I think we came out with energy and played hard. We came out strong, took care of the ball, and just did what we had to do. Being able to have short-term memory and just forgetting about the last game made me do even better the next game. There's another guy, Isaiah Todd. I love his little fall away jumper. He's been very effective at that shot near the bubble. How about that pass? Jalen Green to a bear. Jalen Green has not scored, but he has impacted this game. We've been really working on our basketball IQ because everybody is talented enough to score, but are we smart enough to be able to put all this talent together and work together? They've been saying I can't pass, I can't play many since my freshman year of high school, but it's all right, I'm just going to keep proving them wrong. All 11 players who've played for Ignite today have scored. That means everyone's getting in on the fun. Kaminga. Green rips it away, patient underneath, count it, and one. Coming out of the first half, we have a seven-point lead. We feel great, have energy on our side. Second half, they took all the momentum, took all the energy. Miles Powell wants buckets. Lewis King knocks it down. Tyler Hall ring it up. It was a dog fight. We kind of came out real flat at the beginning of the third quarter. I mean, that seven point lead or whatever we had at halftime, they just absorbed that right away. Off the rim twice, Iggy picks it back up and puts Westchester in front. Jared Harper fading away. He wanted a whistle. And he allows Ashley to go right by him for the layup. Great ball movement, Kaminga spotting Dante Hall. Just a beautiful pass, and Dante Hall finished nicely at the rim. They were up by a little bit, but we fought back. That's Isaiah Todd, a good looking stuff. Iggy. And one. And tonight it's been Isaiah Todd off the bench to lead the team with 14 points. Darren Harper ties it up at 108. Iggy on the drive. His shot rejected. Jalen Green. Punch it down for me one time. Big night back in front. Kick out King. Wants to get downhill. Pull up at the foul line. Too strong. I believe there was a whistle. It's a loose ball foul. And Justin Patton is going to the foul line to shoot two. Big opportunity here for Justin Patton. So far, so good. It was another, it was another level. 
Perfect. A battle for the rebound. Time expires. Regulation over. We're tied at 110. And the regulation went in overtime. As Jared Harper weaves his way in. Kick out Lewis King for three. King, three more. Patton comes up to set the high screen, but he retreats. He gets it. Corner. One more time. Lewis King, his third overtime three. I think, you know, we hit our first wall. Games of every other day, so doing his daily maintenance, making sure your quads are flushed out. And JK has been probably the, the more common one to be in here getting his, his treatment done. What year was he done? 2005. But if you go through it, man, you're not going to be young forever. I and mean, if you want to extend the, the life of your career, getting this part of it done early is paramount. The widows change from whenever you came to the league to now, like, what's the difference? So they didn't have a lot of the luxuries that we have. They would play back-to-back -back games and they have to get up at six in the morning and go in the airport. You know, we have the luxury of flying private planes. And I mean, they, they said if you weren't an older player, you had to sit and coach. That's why I'm always respectful to players that came before me. I know there are certain concessions that they had to deal with that allowed us to, you know, reap the benefits of it. So how do I get a question? I just be asking. Hey, it's Overtime Larry here to tell y'all that this episode of League Ready is brought to you by State Farm. The G League bubble was full of all types of surprises. But when it comes to insurance, you may be surprised about everything you get from State Farm, all for a surprisingly great rate. Don't forget, like a good neighbor, State Farm is there. Two and four Greensboro against four and two G League Ignite. Today we play Greensboro Swarm, coming from two losses. We're trying to get back on track. I think losing in general kind of made us want to win this game even more, especially losing two in a row. This is going to be a fun matchup. A lot of star power here tonight. We are underway. How about Kaminga on the baseline cut for the flush? Very dangerous inside, and Jalen Green just bullying his way to the hoop and laying it in. Him and Vernon Carey kind of collided, and Green got the best of it. I feel like I'm doing good. I feel like I've learned from every game, and I've shown that I've learned from every game. His pass goes off the rim. Now a run out. Kaminga in transition. Kobe Simmons drills the three. Grant Riller hits a deep three. Nice take by Snead to the hoop. Beautiful pass right there. Nation Nix feeding the cutting Cody Demps for the easy lay -in. There's one of those young guns, Isaiah Todd. He has a really nice looking jumper. That's going to be tough to defend. I was in there from the elbows, a lot of mid range. I hit a couple threes. Isaiah Todd there, he loves that little fall away. Three point lead for Ignite. A little more than five minutes gone by. Schofield, no. The tap follow there, though, for Vernon Carey Jr. Three for Sneed. Xavier Sneed eating up. This is getting close. Sneed the rebound quickly to Richards. And somehow finished that one overhaul. So that'll take us to the end of the first quarter. And it's Greensboro with a two point lead. Kaminga from the foul line. Second quarter comes, we start making shots, getting everybody involved, sharing the ball, and we just start playing our game. Pass from the high post into Todd for the flush. Beautiful, watch your head, woo! The way I put it is learning to dance. Once you learn to dance and the rules of the dance, knowing where you're supposed to be, those are the biggest things. Oh, alley -oop for Jalen Green out of the timeout. Oh my goodness. Jalen lives up to the height. Every game he played, you know, spectacular dunks, finishes, or just cross somebody over. I think he lives up to the hype. Let's see what he can do here. Almost lost the handle. He's just going to have to run one up at the horn, and it's oh, good oh, for Kobe Simmons. That's the way to go into the half. We're just ready to keep the momentum going and never let up. Don't stop, hey, don't stop, hey, hey. You know the drops don't stop and neither do the blessings, y'all. If you want to get dripped and fitted like your boy, all you got to do is click the link over here. 
Also, don't forget to subscribe this away and check out more fire videos over here. While y'all do that, I'm gonna tell my mama I'm on overtime.